Getting started with AdWords. Account navigation. Campaign management. To get started, let's talk about creating and managing your AdWords campaigns. You can create a new placement targeted or keyword targeted campaign at any time. To create a new campaign of either type, first sign into your AdWords account. Second, on the campaign summary page, click the create a new campaign link. Third, Click either the placement targeted or keyword targeted link to begin creating a new campaign of that type. If you select placement targeted campaign, follow the sign up wizard instructions to create your campaign. If you select keyword targeted campaign, you'll be offered the option of using the one page sign up wizard, which allows you to copy and edit settings from an existing campaign. To switch to the one page wizard, use the pull down menu. To select an existing campaign to copy, then click Go and follow the instructions on the next page. To use the full multi-page sign-up wizard for a keyword targeted campaign, ignore the one-page sign-up option and follow the regular instructions to create your campaign. The campaign summary page is usually the first page you see when you sign into your account. From here, you can use the Search My Campaigns box to search for words or phrases across all campaigns, ad groups and ads in your account. This is a big help if you're trying to find all references to a particular product or keyword. The Alerts box may contain a yellow, green or red icon providing important information about your account and new AdWords features. For instance, an alert might notify you of a decline payment or an improvement to your billing summary. You can change the status and settings of your campaigns at any time. You can pause, resume, delete or edit campaign settings by checking the box to the left of one or more campaigns and then selecting one of the buttons above the table. If you choose to edit settings, you can edit campaign name, daily budget, language and location targeting, start and end dates, ad distribution preference and other advanced options. The campaign summary table displays summary data about all campaigns in your account. The standard default tab shows information about your AdWords campaigns. If you set up cross-channel conversion tracking, the cross-channel tab shows data for those campaigns. Use the data range drop down menus to select the day or the range of dates you'd like to review. The default setting is show all campaigns, but you can choose to show only active campaigns or all campaigns except those you've deleted. Click the name of any campaign to see the ad groups within that campaign and any other relevant statistics. Status displays the current status of each campaign. A campaign status can be active, paused, deleted, pending or ended. Clicks is the number of clicks ads in each campaign have received. Impressions is the number of times the campaign's ads have been displayed on Google or one of our partner sites. The click-through rate is the number of clicks divided by the number of impressions that a campaign, ad group or keyword has received. This is expressed as a percentage. The average CPC is the average cost accrued for clicks on the ads within that campaign. Cost per conversion is the total cost divided by the total number of conversions. This tells you how much each conversion costs. This also applies only to users who have signed up for conversion tracking. To hide or show any of the above columns, click the Customize Columns link above the campaign summary table. You can access the Edit Campaigns Settings page by way of the Edit Settings button, shown here. The Edit Campaign Settings page contains several sections. The first section is Basic Settings, where you can edit your campaign name and end date. By default, your campaign is set to run continuously unless you select an end date. With budget options, you can change your daily budget or delivery method. With the advanced option, Keyword Bidding, you can select View and Edit Bidding options to choose different ways to bid for your ads, such as with the Budget Optimizer or Preferred CPC Bidding. 
Ad scheduling allows you to set up specific days and times when you want your ads to appear. Position preference enables a specific rank range that you'd like your ads to appear. Ad serving allows you to choose how you'd like different ads in an ad group to compete. Either select optimize to show ads that perform better more often or select rotate to display your ads as equally as possible regardless of performance. With network settings, you can edit where your ads are distributed. Keyword targeted ads are set up to run on Google. You can also choose to have ads run on search network and content network sites in the Google network of partner sites. To modify these settings, select or deselect checkboxes next to a network. You can specify the target audiences, languages and locations you'd like your ads to show for by adjusting your language and location preferences. Once you've changed settings, click the Save Changes link or cancel to return to the original settings instead of saving the new ones.